Bard County Commissioner Brian Lober represented Palm Bay's former deputy city manager. That guy's now facing racketeering and extortion charges. Lober was able to help David Isnardi get out on bond while he awaits trial for those charges. News 6 was there when the former deputy city manager walked out of jail last week. Now here's the problem. Isnardi's wife is also a Brevard County Commissioner. News 6's James Sparvero shows us why this is raising alarms for voters. At, at, Sir, what, point, again about the at what point, at Sir. what point? Their voices raise, but some of their questions about Palm Bay's corruption scandal. Commission Chair Christine Isnardi, has she considered resigning? Falling on deaf ears. I apologize, but you're out of time. And ensure our Ma'am, you're out of time. Notice the empty chair on the Brevard County Commission today. Commissioner Brian Lober says the Isnardis, that's Commissioner Christine, and her husband Dave, the embattled former Palm Bay Deputy City Manager, they are in Virginia, attending their son's graduation from military school. Both Isnardis would not be there had Commissioner Lober not fought to have a judge grant Dave Isnardi a bond. After a week behind bars on racketeering, extortion, and drug charges, Isnardi quickly left the jail last Friday. Lober told the court that Isnardi needed a bond so he could have back surgery. What would you say to some people who think his back looks just fine as he's trying to avoid reporters and get in that car quickly? The same thing I tell the internet and Facebook uh, lawyers and physicians. No one's going to electively have surgery to essentially ruin themselves if they don't have a legitimate medical condition that necessitates it. New tonight, we're learning as Nardi's co-defendant in the alleged blackmail plot to manipulate voting at City Hall will have a bond hearing as well. Jose Aguiar will be in court Friday. We also talked today with Aguiar's attorney, and here at the Vieira Courthouse Friday morning, he tells us he will seek a lower bond for his client than the $36,000 that his Nardi was granted and then posted last Friday. We'll let you know what happens. In Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero, getting results news 6.